Hello people, I am Artemy from War Robots team with another installment of What's Next in War Robots. In this episode we are going to talk about first, what is going on with the update 6.1, second, updated item component costs, then community map, fan tournament, YouTube creator program, and we will also show you some of your incredible art. The fate of 6.1. Unfortunately, fixing performance on factory took us longer than we wanted. We made the hard decision to skip the 6.1 entirely and include factory and all planned quality of life changes in the update 6.2. This wins us about a week that we usually spend clearing everything up in the preparation for the release. We plan to use this extra time and resources to complete 6.2 content earlier than planned. Now we expect to land it by the end of June instead of early July. Thank you for your patience. Updated component costs. We are tuning the costs of components for certain items to make them more in line with their power. As a result, Spark, Viper and Scourge will require more resources to obtain and maintain. But on the other hand, a much bigger bunch of items got way more accessible both in terms of purchase and upgrade costs. The biggest highlights are probably Dragoon and Amber, prices of which are going to be cut almost in half. I'd also like to point out a Termite. Those boys just received a significant buff recently and it might be a nice time to try them out for some sneaky attack from behind the wall action. The changes will go live on June 15th. You can still get those items with their old prices before that happens. Community map. Life after factory. The community map is basically a map that we are working together with you in social media. The development of that map is going full steam ahead. The first trials of its mechanics and its geometry are already happening on test server. In case if you missed it, the map itself is a platform built above a huge volcanic pipe. It also has teleports, like built-in teleports on this map that are already working. One thing that map doesn't have yet is a name. Last week we asked people on social media to suggest their ideas for it. We have received hundreds and hundreds of great ideas. Soon enough, you and I will know which ones will be chosen to be the final names of community map. Fan tournaments. The iOS fan tournament has concluded this weekend. Watch the replay with commentary on Mr. Bolgasari channel or check this video from Adrian Chong to see this tournament from his point of view. And prepare for the Android Faction Wars tournament. The registration for this tournament is closed now, but you can always follow with and cheer for the team and Faction Wars Discord. Link in description. Matches are currently planned to begin by the end of June. Organizing tournaments is kind of tough right now, and this makes the work of those who are willing to pull through and run those competitions even more incredible. Go give the guys your support. And meanwhile, we'll be definitely looking into expanding the competitive side of War Robots in the future. And right now we are going to do what is possible to help the War Robots tournament scene to grow and flourish. The YouTube Creator program is now online. You can find the link in the description down below. If you have registered already and didn't receive the confirmation, you are going to receive it very soon. Right now there are issues with processing some channels, which we are going to resolve very soon. Don't worry, if you have already submitted your channel in the form, nothing will be lost. We have also noticed that some people have troubles with verifying their channels. We have tweaked the submission form to be more clear on how to make it work. To put it the shortest way possible, make sure your in-game ID matches the ID you include in the description or, in, or the tags of your best video. This way we can make sure that this channel belongs to you and protect you from impersonators. And finally, let's conclude this episode of What's Next with some art highlights. First, take a look at this incredible rendition of Festive Fenrir, Deathwing Aojun and Ivory Ravenna by Fazbear's from Japan. And here are some amazing LEGO models by Atom Bubble from Reddit. Thank you guys for your amazing art and thank you for watching. See you in the next video.